RSN presents Under the Hood, featuring The King. For over 20 years, Dinoco's golden boy Strip Weathers, more commonly known as The King, has set the bar in racing. As the winningest racer in Piston Cup history, he boasts a whopping seven Piston Cup championships. Tonight, we get an intimate look at the two sides of our favorite king, relentless racer and great family man. You sure made Dinoco proud. Wouldn't be nothing without you. The king was built to be a champion. His sleek wing gives him optimum aerodynamics. His engine and smooth body type are a force to be reckoned with. But it wasn't always easy. Strip began as an unassuming racer getting his tires dusty on the Piston Cup circuit. It would take years of hard work before gaining attention and support from his sponsor, Tex Dynaco. Ah, ah, look at that boy go out there! The two shared a core belief that winning isn't everything. But that's easy to say when you're always winning. The king and chick rounding turn four. That was until the Dynaco 400, meant to be his farewell race, ended in a never before seen three-way tie with Chick Hicks and rookie sensation Lightning McQueen. These three were destined for a tiebreaker. The most spectacular, amazing, unequivocally unbelievable ending in the history of the world. After a staggering seven Piston Cup championships, the King would face his fiercest and most dangerous competition in the final race of his career. Many experts are calling the race of the century. Hey King, good luck in your last race. You sure been an inspiration to me. Thanks Junior, appreciate it. Hey, be careful out there, okay? Yeah man an inspiration to future racers, and a symbol of professionalism. Oh yeah, this is what it's all about. The devastating tragedy to come is hard to look back on. Come on, you can do come it. Come on, King, make us proud, boy. Within eye shot of winning the Piston Cup. I am not coming in behind you again, old man. The King was bumped into a tailspin, lifting him in the air and sending him nearly 50 yards down the track. The silence in the speedway was deafening. Oh no. What happened next shows the power of paying it forward. He finished his race that day. You just gave up the piston cut. You know then? Ah, this grumpy old race car I know once told me something. It's just an empty cup. Although it was his last as a racer, he proved to us the respect he garnered over the years tops any piston cup he could ever win. The King now spends his much earned free time with his first love, his family but he hasn't left Piston Cup racing entirely. Currently, the crew chief for his nephew, Cal Weathers, the King's appreciation for Dynaco and the sport of racing endure. This ain't a one-man deal, kid. If you figure that out, you're just gonna be okay. 